Welcome back, everybody. As usual, this is Skykiller63, and I'm back in Pixelmon. So, I think I'm gonna go ahead and just record three episodes, three or four episodes in a row. This is this will be my third episode. But welcome to episode seven. Ah, man, I'm having so much fun playing this. I'm gonna go ahead and head on over to Bill's house. After I caught my Abra last last uh, episode with my. Oh, maybe giant is bigger than enormous. You know what? I'm gonna go look this up. I'll be right back. All right. So it turns out I was correct. The uh, the list from smallest to largest is pygmy, runt, small, ordinary, and then there's large, huge, which is what these three are. And then there's uh, giant and enormous. So, wait, I think these three were all, um, huge. Huge. Huge, huge, yeah, and then they're, enormous is the biggest, and giant is one under that. So, it may just, it just looks like Arrow's bigger, but I think just Charmeleon in general is a smaller Pokemon. So, that might be the issue there. Other than that, yeah, let's get started again. Woo! Abra. Then let's bring out... Pidgeotto here. Gust. Super effective. Nice. He's got Geodude, Geodude there. Sadly, I don't. I still don't have any um water type moves, even though I've got a water type Pokemon. I think I'm gonna look up the uh, move set learn for Gyarados. Oops, using the wrong mouse. So, what I really need is the, um... Nice. What I need is the, um... Shoot, what was I saying? Is the, uh, TM Aerial Ace to teach Pidgeotto. I don't remember where I get that, though. Holy cow, that Rattata almost killed me. Thundershock. Aww. Nice. So, it appears that the first time Gyarados um, learns the water move is at level 35. Isn't, doesn't that kind of suck? It's, and it's Aqua Tail. It's a good move, but I mean, that sucks. Oops, I don't want to... Uh, that. Whoa, 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 wait, wait a second. It's purple. What? That's interesting. Let's try Electro Ball. Ooh, one shot. Nice. Let's see, how much... 6 out of 60, so I can use a super potion, but should I? Yes, I should. Man, imagine if that thing was an enormous Gyarados. That'd be hilarious. Man, I ever go to level 15, alright. That's a Needle? Needle Ram? Just bite him. Uh, bite him again. So, the next move this guy learns is Dragon Rage at level 23. Which, that's a good move as well. And then, it's basically just a bunch of crap. However, he does learn, um, he does learn natural, um, Ice Fang, which is a pretty good move. It's a nice ice move. Just wrecking face with this Charmeleon. Oh, this guy's got more than 40 health. 
Let's just ember him then. Ooh, yay! Abra's evolving. Let's see how big this cadaver gets. Oh, and then I might have to get my brother on to help me um, evolve him into a cadaver. Or Alakazam, I mean. I always thought it was fun. It, when I finally got this joke, and um, when I was a lot younger, you know, it's it's the the evolution list is Abra, Kadabra, and then Alakazam. So Abra Kadabra, Alakazam. You know, it's just a common like stuff to do. You know what I mean? Okay. Um, I think I might have to relog. Wait, what 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 move did I just get? Hidden power, okay. Yeah, see I knew I was missing a guy. So this guy should have learned confusion, yeah. Whoa there. Cadaver is a beast. Oh, this guy's gonna be one shot. Cadaver is a beast, man. I might learn that here in a little bit. I'm almost to Bill's house. I looked at the move lists for um, Kadabra and Alakazam, and it appears there's no difference. So, I mean, I guess I could just evolve him now, and there wouldn't really be any downfall to it, to what I see. I do remember, though, that it was, like, people were always saying it's best better to um, let your Pokemon grow a bunch of levels and then evolve them. Because then it was like, then it was something like they um grew more. Uh, shoot, what was it? they grew more? They got a lot more XP or something. That's what I remember from that. But that was such a long time ago, and I don't even know if that was true or not. I need to fight a Pokemon real quick so I can see my Pokemon. Alright, let's head on into Bill's house after I just ran completely back. I'm glad I got these running shoes, dude. They're so fast. Alright. After talking to me, flip this... Oh, okay. Talk to him. Hey, uh, hiya! I'm a Pokemon. No, I'm not. Call me Bill. I'm a true blue Pokemaniac. Hey, what's with that skeptical look? I'm not joshing you, pal. I screwed up an experiment and got combined with a Pokemon. So how about it? Help me out here? Wait till I get inside the teleporter. When I do, go to my PC and run the cell separation system. Alright. Wait for him to walk in. Go in, buddy. Close it. Yeah, hey dog. Wait on you. Good job, Pixelmon. Way to make your th game work. Maybe I just gotta punch him. I can't punch him. Just sit here and wait for him to come out. Did he come out? Wait, what happened to that guy? Okay, well, whatever. Yeah, thanks bud, I owe you one. So, did you come to see my Pokemon collection? You didn't? That's a bummer, I've got to thank you. Oh, here, maybe this'll do. That cruise ship, SSN, is in Vermilion City. I heard there are lots of trainers on board, too. They invited me to their party, but I can't stand fancy dues. Why don't you go instead of me? Go on and have a good time. Alright, thanks. So, I got the SS ticket here now. Yay, me. So, since I got that, I guess we can head on down to uh, Vermilion City. Let's see what these two have to say. This cave is famous dates by Misty, the gym leader. Oh, yeah, I gotta fight the gym leader. Let's go fight the gym leader. Got my Pikachu out. I'm a wreck face. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, that ever was big, too. Alright, so before I do that, I gotta go kill my Pokemon first. That's not it. And the gem is right next to it, thankfully. Woo! I almost forgot about fighting Misty. And I still got a couple minutes left until this episode needs to be over. So I don't know exactly what I should put in my fifth party. I'm thinking... 
I completed a quest apparently. I sense that. Okay, so I've got water, flying. Oh, I need a fighting type. Hmm. I wonder what fighting type I could use. Well, what fighting types are there? There's Mankey. You know, there's the Hitmonchan, Hitmonlee. Um. There's Machop. Or Machop. Um. I don't know, I'll think about it. But a fighting type would be nice. So let's fight Lewis here. He's swimming in the water. Electro Ball. Shoulder! Oh, these Shoulder. guys are tough. Let's fight Diana over there. Double team. Well, maybe. Oops. I wanted to use Electro Ball. Nice. Alright, so let's talk to uh, Misty here. Nice skin, Misty. Hiya. Oops. Let me go back. I didn't finish talking to her. Hi, you're a new face. Only those trainers who have a policy about Pokemon can turn pro. What is your approach when you catch and train Pokemon? My policy is an all-out offensive water type Pokemon. Battle? Alright. And she's gone. There we go. Okay. So we got ourselves a uh, Star U. Let's go ahead and Electro Ball the crap out of this thing. Bam. And Electro Ball one more time. Oops. Okay. One more time. <laughs> nice. Woo. Um, talk to Misty. Quest. What's wrong with Quest? It appears there is something wrong with Quest. Let me relog. Maybe I broke it. Maybe I did the quest wrong. Maybe I was supposed to do quest first, then battle her. Oh, she's back. Okay, well, I can't battle her again. Oops, I don't want to go back here. Quest. Yeah, I think something's wrong with that. Let's see, Water Pulse? Is that a TM? Let me open the LAN real quick. I'll let him know of that right now. Um, game mode 1. Pulse. No, is it really not? That, that should be a TM. I'm pretty sure that was a TM. I don't know what he has in place for it, then. Not very many water moves, though. Surf, whirlpool, dive. Hmm. I don't know. Well, I guess... Since I defeated her, I will talk to you guys later, and I'll get an update on that, and let you guys know what the result of that is. So, thank you everybody for watching. Go ahead and check this dude out. He's doing a great job. He hardly messes up. <laughs> thank you everybody for watching. Have a good one.